this area is off limits. My eyes soon in. ahead. timing we would have stormed the place without you what have you seen soldiers are plenty wagons going in and out that weasel Borgred is here I'm sure of it the bathhouse there and that church see I sent a scout to check them both should be back at any moment now did you see Uba and Sigurd in Templerbrach? no and if Borgred is hiding here I won't have to there is a lot we would not have to do if we stuck to killing kings. Thanks to my brother, now we are into making them. No small tension between you two. Thought you'd be more like-minded. You and Sigurd, you always see eye to eye? More often than not. You are still young. You live to my age and you will see. The closer you get, the greater the stink that rises. Time's up for your scout, I'd say. He's either dead or run off. Give him a chance. Can't risk them seeing us and Burkrit slipping away again. You stay here and wait for your scout. I'm going in.
see you, old friend. This must be the bathhouse. Need to find a way inside. We keep our wits about us. <coughs> Have a look, Sunan. Survey the area soon and we should be cautious around here. We're to secure our food stores first. Lay off Frith's orders. Lay off Frith's orders? <laughs> the king's grown tired of him, you know. That's what all the men are saying. Tired? How do you mean? Are you flying? He questions Burgrid's orders every chance he gets. That's done ever since the Danes showed up. of goods they've hidden away.
My eyes. Jailbird. Have you lost your mind? I feared you were one of them. Keep quiet. What are you doing here? I'm... I was looking for Burgred. You are Eva's scout. I hoped I might find Burgred myself and talk him into surrendering. But he's not in Lederchester. How can you be sure? Leofrith passed this way with some men. I eavesdropped. It seems they're only stockpiling food here. But he did say something of interest. Gave orders to send more men to Burgred's wife, the Lady Arvelsmith. She's in Templebloch. She would know where Burgred's hiding. The sounds of battle. Eva! Let's get you out of here now. Where are you going? I know my way around. We'll go through the market. This way. <gasps> Close to me. What? What do I do? Fight, man! Fight! <laughs> Hurt. Speak up. I... I don't think so. My God. I didn't want it to come to this. They would have killed you, Chilbert. You had no choice. Now don't move. Where is your king, Saxon? Where is he? Lord our father, grant me salvation. <laughs> When does their god find the time to answer so much mumbling and whimpering? You're reckless, Ivar. Cheobed could have been killed. Who am I to stand in the light of a boy searching for his boss? Don't excuse yourself. You enjoy this too much. Stop. It wasn't Ivar who sent me. I sent myself. Have caution, boy. Until your father is crowned your Mercia's enemy, not its champion. You understand? I understand. Good. Now return to Repton and remain there until we call. Will you not stay, Wolfkist? There is no king, but we have corpses to loot. Burgred's lady Arthelsweth is in Templebroth. I'm going to find out what she knows. Take everything!
Pile the soldiers here. Let these people bear witness to the carnage that awaits their kingdom. Whoever trains these mercy and soldiers should be relieved of their duty, I think. My battle cannings have worn thin. I am no longer the reed among shields, the glimmer blood, the hallowed skull crack. The scourge of swan roads. The iron throng. The lender of silver gelds. I only wish to be a freebooter. Someone who writes their own destiny. Be glad you head to Valhalla with a poem on your lips. Ugh! <sighs> 